So I use a container or bowl, and then you put your strawberries in a strainer, and put the strainer into your um, container or bowl, and then I add water and some vinegar, and add the strawberries back in and then just mix them around a little bit. And then you'll see, and then add one and a half teaspoon of baking soda. And then mm, I mix them all. I mix them so that there's no like um, baking soda left on it. And then you'll start to see that there, there's dirty leaves falling. And then I add one teaspoon salt and then mix it. And then just like move the strain a little bit. And then I added a little bit more salt and then mix. I've seen many people do this, but they only use one thing, so now I'm trying to use all three to see what the reaction is. And then you have to let it sit for 20, I have to let it sit for 20 minutes. So I'm not good at tra keeping track of time, so I put a timer on for 20 minutes. And now the water's already getting really dirty, but you just gotta wait for 20 more minutes. And it's already that dirty. So I'll show you when 20 minutes are done. Okay, 20 minutes are done. Let's look at the water. Oh my God, the water is like yellowish, brownish, and there's like, ew. So I'm gonna remove the strawberries and just like move it around. And now just do a final rinse to take all those dirty stuff off. And here's your strawberries. And now if you want to keep them this way, put them in a, a airtight container. I put them. You could do that or just dump them in like I did. And just look for some bad strawberries that, and make sure to take them out. And those are your perfectly clean strawberries. And they're really shiny too.